ain't catch a vibe, yeah, I had to put her on Bought a two-seater, yeah, we heading for the sun Shawty got my heart, I ain't tripping for the fun What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Justin and Mahogany YouTube channel, guys. I'm your boy, Justin. And I'm Mahogany. And listen, do us a big favor. Hit the subscribe button. Turn on that post notification bell. And when you do, make sure you guys comment down below so that we can shout you out. You heard me? Period. Listen, guys, thanks for being the true supporters that you are. If you are not following us on Facebook, make sure you head over to Facebook and follow us. Mm -hmm. And make sure you follow us on Instagram at Justin and, and Mahogany. Mahogany. Yes. 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 Anyway, today, 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 what are we doing? We are going to be doing something super special. Guys, I'm really excited about it. Um, we're going to be doing how well do we know each other after... Is seven, seven or years. do we want to say eight years? Uh, seven years. Seven years married. We're coming up on seven. Yeah, seven years married. So not quite eight. If we go by married years, that means you shouldn't get nothing wrong. You shouldn't get nothing wrong. Do us a be fair. As you get ready, as we get ready to jump in, make sure you get this video to two thousand likes yes yeah, two thousand likes and we'll make sure we drop another banger once again so you got we can get ready to figure out who knows who each other who knows each other the best i'm sitting here i kind of glance at your questions and i feel set up don't kind of <laughs> glance at my questions come on I feel set you don't up. post to know my I feel questions set up. somebody's phone died so we had to use my phone to record so <laughs> Hit the questions on this iPad. Ah, let me stop. What is my Subway order? When you go to Subway? <laughs> so crazy. Yeah. Oh, gosh. So what, what you getting now, what you used to get? Not what I used to get. You have to stay up to date and current and relevant. Yeah, so current. Okay, so current. So when she gets current, she gets Italian bread, mm -hmm. ham and turkey. Mm -hmm. You get the shredded uh, cheese. <laughs> what they call it? The cheddar. Mm -hmm. Shredded cheddar cheese. Mm -hmm. Then you get mayonnaise, mm -hmm. lettuce, mm -hmm. uh, Italian dressing mm -hmm. on the side. Not toasted. Not toasted. I can't stand it toasted. Did I get it right? Yeah. Do I get propolone on it? I can't remember. Or do I just get the cheddar cheese? You get the cheddar That's cheese. The cheddar just cheese. the cheddar. Okay, that was good. You do get it toasted. No, I don't like it toasted. I thought they melt that cheddar on it. No. Okay, okay. Don't go back on your stuff. <laughs> I can't stand it toasted, y'all. Because it when you get it toasted, it takes it from like a cold cut to like a warm ham sandwich. Oh, that's good. I had it one time. I said, I'm going to try what she got, y'all. So I got it. I got mine toasted and got yours regular. It tastes good toasted. Yeah, it tastes taste like a, a warm ham a and turkey. A warm ham and turkey. Who wants that? I want mine to taste like a cold cut sandwich. All right, what's my favorite fast food restaurant now? I ain't gonna say favorite fast food because I'm also, it's not really fast food, but what is my favorite restaurant name that I can always go to? Is there like, a, if you don't know the answer, what do you No, know? you, you gotta that? know the answer. You're supposed to know me. <laughs> <laughs> Justin. All right. Waffle House. Oh, you yeah, should Waffle know that. House. Come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> Probably has a place I hate. <laughs> yeah, she hates it. I love yeah, Waffle House. Y'all, I would pull over. I would pull over to a Waffle House real quick because they do, real, especially during the day. I pull over to Waffle House real quick. They get 10 minutes. You can be in and out. And I ain't got my all star and walk out the door. What I order when I go to Waffle House? <laughs> No, it's like a pack. <laughs> I mean, I don't know because y'all, I mean, I know, but I don't what, like. What's my order? First of all, Justin literally does all the picking up of orders. I don't even pick up But order. what would be my like, order? It's, you get like this cheese patty milk. Okay, okay. okay. Um, Texas patty Texas milk. patty milk. Okay. Uh, but what? That sounds gross. Um, And then you get it with mayonnaise. Uh -huh. Not that much. And what and else? And you get a waffle. Um, uh -huh. Man, you get like five eggs or something with cheese. <laughs> you know, stop acting like you don't know. So I get a patty milk. What is on my patty milk? Come on. You act like you get sandwich. You know what no, I mean? because his order be insane. I'm like. But ain't nobody ask you about this. What do I get on my patty milk? This marriage, we used to eat at Waffle House. He did one from three eggs and cheese. See, <laughs> that ain't what we talking about. That's rude. What do I get on my patty milk? I just think that's a that's rude. That's not the question. <laughs> what do I get on my patty milk? It's not, it's not, I'm not being rude. Yes, it is rude. What do I get on my patty milk? On the patty milk, uh, you get the, I know you get mayonnaise for sure. Uh-huh. Um, it already comes with cheese. Mm-hmm. What other sauce? Um, ketchup. Ketchup, that's right. Then what I get on the side now? Sausage. Okay. 
Make sure I get a pet amount and an all star on the side, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, anybody ask you all that stuff? No, it's hilarious. To yeah, me. whatever. What's my favorite place I like to order clothes? Fashion over. Yeah, that was easy. What do the kids kids do that annoy me? So much stuff seems like. What is that one thing that the kids do? You got too much extra <laughs> lip for your questions. What is one thing that the kids do that annoy me? Jeez, I, that I know I don't tolerate. Just randomly one thing? One thing, everybody. Oh, crying? <laughs> crying. <laughs> crying for no reason. <laughs> I can't say, I don't mind if you cry, you get hurt, you fall, I understand. But when somebody takes something, you'll tell you to do something, you start crying. I don't talk, I don't let them do that because, it, you know, you understand. So that crime, we cut that, we don't do no crime when you're getting corrected. Because at the end of the day, you know what you did. But when you fall, something that's different. When you just sit there crying, I haven't said, put that down, you, nah, <laughs> that gets on my nerves. What food do I hate? Uh, I don't know, that's tough, because I be hating stuff in different seasons and stuff. I'm probably snacking for y'all. Like, oh, um, what food do you hate? Mm-hmm. Mm, I don't know that one. One thing that I hate, y'all, y'all write a question to me sitting here wondering yourself. I mean, I guess it just all depends. Like, I kind of wasn't looking for like a specific thing, but like a group of foods. Like, what food is not my favorite? I guess your favorite, you don't really like, you don't hate it, but you don't fool with soul food like that. I don't hate soul food, though. I don't know, something that I hate. We was in a store the other day. Like, it, it's a lot of things I hate, but just think of one thing that I hate. What, I can't think of anything. Like, we was in a store the other day, and I was like, oh, we can add this to the queso dip. And he was like, well, honey, you really don't like that. I don't know what was that. Hot dogs? I hate Ooh, Oh, yeah, God. you don't like hot dogs. I don't know what it is with hot dogs. Yeah, she I don't like hot dogs. Hot dogs they are trifling. What's my favorite thing to get at a restaurant? Or it's like a restaurant or lounge when we go out? Hookah? That's right. <laughs> I gotta get that hookah back. Just gonna order that hookah. I'm gonna care. order. I'm gonna order that hookah. I don't care how much it costs. Before they before they bring that water to the table, I'm gonna have that hookah at the table. What's my favorite genre of music? R&B. You got that right. I love me some R&B music, y'all. I'm, I'm 90. I'm, I'm like a 90s baby, so 90s to 2000. I 99 love. to 2000. Three, what kind of music? <laughs> what the hell is she talking about? But I love um, R&B music. I think R&B music is like, it's almost like gospel music. It just I never go out of style. You so always need it. Of the whole, huh? Come on, it's almost like gospel music. On two well, what I mean by I that, it never classic. go out. It's a classic. Yeah. Even some church music, we don't listen to them today. But you, t you put them on in the right spot, they never take you back. What's my ice cream order? Ice cream or milkshake? Because you, you don't get do much eat. ice cream. I ain't been getting the ice cream lately. Like, I really like a milkshake for real, for real. So, milkshake order. My husband is always going to order something like a cotton candy. Um, something that's very, got a lot of flavor to it. But cotton candy is usually what you're going to go with. Something that. Something like, that. Like, I don't know where that came from, y'all. My mom loves cotton candy and birthday cake. And I don't know if it just came from me always, like, having some of her ice cream. Now, that's all I get. Like, that was so unintentional. You've always gotten cotton candy or something. And that's literally my mom's You order. don't get, I, now, I, I always get cookies and cream. Mm -hmm. But you, cotton candy, cotton, and, oh, birthday cake. Yeah. Oh, God. Don't never bring my heart anything else. Don't bring no vanilla. Don't bring no oh chocolate. Gosh, I can't birthday cake it was or gross. cotton candy or birthday cake. She gon' that's what she want. Ice cream. What do you do that annoys me the most? Be late. No. Really? No. no. That's not that. That's not that. Don't annoy me the most. I that know. that's second. I will say that's second. I know that was not coming in hot. No, that's hot, second. Hot. <laughs> I genuinely don't know outside of being late. That's oh, you know this about. one. Why are you looking like that? What is it? Why are you looking like that? What is it? <laughs> what is it, Justin? What is? Come on, you know. Is it like they related? I don't know. What is it? I have no idea. You talking too much. Oh yeah. That's talking nice. too much. So y'all, yeah, we have this. Weird can't can't get her to do a blowjob, but she in there talking. We have this weird thing, y'all. She talks it's a like, lot. You talk a lot. I talk a lot, but that's like my love language. So it kind of goes back and forth. But it's a no. Like, no, that is not a love language when a full movie is going on and somebody's watching. 
That's not a love language. That is rude. You talk too much. What household chore do I hate doing the most? All of them. Stop playing. <laughs> all of them. Oh, you hear me? You honor. Do you pop? Do you swear to tell the truth and never but the truth? All of them. Now I say the one you probably hate out of all, you still hate all of them. But the one you hate probably is washing dishes. Yes. You act like that's so dis. Oh, we. I can't stand washing dishes. But I think you because it's like, your dishes. Here, I think because growing up, my mom made me wash dishes so freaking much. But it's your dishes. Still, I don't want to wash them. You, she'll call me. Can you come over there and get a pan clear? And you know, you know, to me, I don't mind washing because I've had jobs where I had to wash Good like dishes, and that's disgusting because I don't, you know, you yeah, you got, some people saliva. So but yeah, to me, that. if it's your dishes, I don't mind like the pot need cleaning. You gotta put, put your hand in and get the cheese out, whatever. That's your pot. Yeah, I couldn't stand. Wash I, your dishes. I know somebody else can relate. Like I can't stand when, cause back in the day when my mom used to make wash dishes. Like it used to be like a pot of a thing of soapy water and, yeah. and food floating in there. I would just want to throw up. I'm like, no, nah, I can't. I can't live like this. What is one store that I like shopping at? H&M. Yep. I like H&M, y'all. They got H&M always got some nice clothes. Between H&M and I'm starting to like Fashion Nova. Yeah, I, w I wanted him to like Fashion Nova, but Fashion Nova, Fashion Nova didn't Nova have a good men, men collection at first. I will say, didn't. probably for me the last six months. They've elevated. They've elevated, and I, and I can see me wearing some. But at first, it was too. I like streetwear, but it was too, uh, uh, too streetwear. Too streetwear. And I was like, no medium. to me, they're starting to come over. They're getting cardigans, and you're getting your, you know, I could. They to me, they got more of gentleman clothes. They're starting right. to get. So I, I'm starting to like their look. What college did I go to, and what was my major? All right, so the college that you attended for a little while because you dropped out. Dang. Um. Oh, and that was too much. I know you was giving a lot of information. We cut that out. <laughs> I know we cut that out. I know you was giving a lot of extra information. That was unnecessary. But you know, you was giving a lot of information to begin, right? But uh, you went to Lynchburg College. Mm -hmm. And was your major psychology? That was my... um Minor? What was, was your major? I think my major was business. Oh, was it business? Yeah, because I had to take microeconomics and all that. Okay. But then my minor was psychology. Gotcha. I got one more question, though. All right. Who's my favorite rap artist right now? Lil Baby. Yes, I love Lil yeah, Baby. Yeah, Lil Baby's good. Who's my favorite preacher to listen to? TDJ. That's my man it's right no, there. It's no. Get ready, get ready. I can listen to everybody else, but it's something about Bishop T.D. Jakes, y'all. Ain't nothing like him. I don't care. I would listen because a lot of people say you shouldn't listen to just one person. I listen to a lot of people, but it's something about that Bishop T.D. Jakes. I love me some Bishop T.D. Jakes, What's one message that you can think of real quick that really changed you? Oh, that changed me? Mm -hmm. Oh, he got so many. You can never. I would say his one of his messages that stood out to me, I would say a two. One recently was a steward of a chance. Mm -hmm. And... The one one that I really loved that he did like a series on that he taped him was his household one. Yeah, uh, I can't remember the name. Grounded in home. Grounded in home. home. That Grounded was good. Yeah. That was good. But I love me some Bishop TDJ. What am I allergic to? Is it Pacer Ceiling? Pacer Ceiling. What's the name? Penicillin. Of it? That's, that's the name I'm saying. What is it? Justin. Macacillin. What's no. it? No. What you? Uh, you have to get it right. No, I don't know the name of it. Pacer Ceiling. How you pronounce it? You know, penicillin. The, you know what the hell I'm talking about? Penicillin, penicillin. No, because it's different ones. It's an amoxicillin. They know I right. As long as I'm saying P at the hospital, ah, they yeah. know which one I'm talking about. They can think you're talking about psychocillin or something. You need to know which one. Um, What's my favorite thing I like to do during my free time? Watch TV? Watch what on TV? Like watch movies? You said watch TV. I get watch movies. I mean, to me, really, more movies. Yeah, I'm yeah. a movie person. You are definitely a movie person. I guess the only reason I said TV shows is because right now nothing's on there as far as movies. So I feel oh, like yeah. you've been watching a lot of series. Yeah, I've been watching a lot of um, series. Because I can't think of the last movie that we really watched that was really good. Yeah. Uh, it's been a minute. If I could travel anywhere, where would I go today? Greece. Yeah, that would be really nice. Is that the place? I don't know. It's a bunch of places. Oh, okay. I, I, um, MIQ. I was just going to see where you where you would land, but MIQ, if I could go anywhere, it'll probably be the Grand Canyon. I do really like the exhibits they have over there. Um, like Mount Rushmore. You agree? One thing about my audience, that's not a vacation, though. 
Well, when you say it, whatever you can do. Yeah, I don't like tours. If I'm going on vacation, that's the only thing. Tours, them stuff, that's kind of bored me. <laughs> <laughs> she wants to go to Grand. I don't mind going to Grand Canyon, but we got to go somewhere else after that. So while we there, I'm not just going to go to Grand Canyon to look at it. Like, oh my gosh, y'all. I All mean, right, fly me quick. in, fly me out. Let's look at it. We out. Real quick, y'all. I'm going to put You, a you, you like to go there, get some rock, get some dirt, bring it back in the bag, look at it. All right, y'all, real quick. <laughs> All right, I'm going to put on the screen uh, this place called Rainbow Canyon. Mm -hmm. Look at this. It's so beautiful. I'm just amazed by like God's creations. Like it's wow. Mm -hmm. Mount Rushmore. There's like different things. Mm -hmm. Not saying that's necessarily God's creation, but you get what I'm saying. Like yeah. just the different things out here. I'm, you know, I guess kind of grown, not grown up, but being here in Atlanta, I see so many things. So many celebrities. Like I met celebrities. Like you know the the fast life, the big city, the lights and all that. That stuff was cool. But I really like to see stuff mm -hmm. and gain experiences that I've never like gained before. You know. What is something that I enjoy eating but can't eat no more of? Dang. I mean, I knew the answer when you first started, but you can't eat no more of. Yeah, I really can't eat more Spicy of it too food? much. Yes, Lord. Yeah. I eat this stuff, then my booty hole starts oh, burning. Man, that's <laughs> too much. That was too much. Jessica. It do. Do you not have a filter? All right, next. Who is my celebrity crush? Morris Chestnut. I actually didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> what you smile, folks? Smile too big. You trying to get your head. <laughs> but I really don't do the. I really don't do the celebrity crushes. I really don't. I was just like, gonna see what you would say, just to see. Yeah, more. But Chesna. then I think of Morris Chestnut. I'm like, yeah, I guess I could be a celebrity crush. But I'm not like crush, y'all. I'm really not a celebrity mm -hmm. crush type person. Mm -hmm. But I guess if anybody don't come up missing. You're like, more chestnut hurt out here. In the <laughs> what is something that I hated doing when you met me that I enjoy doing now? I don't know if you enjoy doing anything really. To me, you still. Mm, I mean, because you do the touristy stuff with me. Like, you used to claim you hate doing that. I don't know if you love it. I think a lot of things you just do because you know I like to do it. So you're just like, all right, let me do it for mahogany. You know, mm. and you don't say nothing. I don't think you fell in love with doing any of it, really, though. I, uh, I like walking. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I got to introduce you to walking. I mean, so I like trails and yeah. stuff back in Lynchburg. Yeah, I didn't like this stuff. Yeah. What is one thing I don't like at my house? To me, it's yes. Yes, Lord. <laughs> You got, a, you, got, you got a time limit. You got limit. a house. It can't even happen. Listen, got a time limit. I do not I get it. I do not like a... I, I don't mind. I'm getting better because my space is growing. Probably not even get a bigger house. I enjoy it. But I do like a certain time. I think everybody's like, you like a certain time living going about your business. Um, My last question was, where is my favorite place to get food right now? Oh, uh, Shane. Yes, I don't Shane's know why I'm on a, Shane. I'm on a Shane's thing. Shane's, but she loves. I do not like their pork. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go right into it. I do not like bread. I, I, I do not like they. I don't like their ribs. Um, yeah. To me, See, I, the best fall off the bone rib I had was cheddar. I was about to say, but don't you think they're better than them? No, when it comes to my ribs. No, I love cheddar. Have you, go, you had Shane Rib Shack's ribs? Yes, I did. And I got them. They were dry. And I said, what the devil is this? I no, I, I did not like that. I Only thing that. I like from Shane Rib Shack is their peach cobbler yeah, and their good. potato salad. Their potato salad. But so their ribs, Mahan gets their pork too. To me, it's the most nasty. I don't care. I've had better pork. I mean, I've tasted some better pulled pork, um, but it's all the way in the heart of Atlanta. And I live way too far to go yeah. there. Shane's, I think, it's like a fast... Change is fast food, and to me, it's more franchise. It is. I want to try more restaurants, so I found two that I'm going to try out that are not as big as though as Shane's to me. I want to see, but I didn't like Shane's. Yeah, that is good. I, mean, I didn't like really their want pork. Some, if you want some pork, like, real fast, like, oh, let me grab me some barbecue. It ain't good. You can cook that at home. You can cook that at home. You can cook, that, no, at you cook, that. You can cook that at home. That, I that mean, stuff that's ain't my good. grandma make. My grandma did. That's how I make it. I can cook Please. good pork. No, you can't do Watch me. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, I think I knew you more than you knew me. Guys, you put questions you didn't know the answer to yourself on there. I was, I was, I, I thought I was walking was my last one. I, I know that one. I was kind of puzzled. I'm like, where is something? But anyway, I think I still won. You think so? Yeah. You guys, let us know down in the comments. Who you think? Who you won. think won, y'all? Um. Yeah.
Yeah, let's know. It was fun. But guys, listen. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. Let's get this video to 2,000 likes. You heard me? 2,000 likes, and we'll make sure we drop another banger once again, guys. Listen. Thanks for hanging out with us today. Listen, guys, my name is Justin. And I'm Mahogany. And guys, until next time, remember, if you keep it locked. We're going to show you how to keep your life lit. Listen, you ain't got to get up off this here channel. Mm -hmm. You got to do, you got to click up off this here video. We'll see you in the next vlog. We're out of here. Try to catch a vibe, yeah, I had to put her on Bought a two-seater, yeah, we heading for the sun Shawty got my high, I ain't trippin' for the fun